acting as a light fighter jet, the JL-10 has six hardpoints, four underwings and two wingtips, to carry various weapons in the form of a combination of missiles and bombs up to 3.5 tons. As propulsion, two turbofan engines are available, namely the Ivshenko Progress AI-222K25 or the AI-22-25F series. The aircraft has a performance with a maximum speed of 1,715 km slash hour, a flying height of up to 16,000 meters, and an operating range of 550 km. Apart from being used for the domestic military, the JL-10 is also exported to other countries as the L-15. The first user is Zambia, namely an aircraft with the code L-15Z which was delivered in 2017. The second country that will use the L-15 also comes from the African continent, namely Ethiopia. This country ordered the L-15 in early 2022 to replace the aging MiG-23 fighter jet. Meanwhile, other potential customers come from China's friendly countries, namely Pakistan, and two countries from Latin America, namely Uruguay and Bolivia. The Hongdu L-15 Falcon made its maiden flight in 2006. The development of this aircraft was assisted by the Russian Yakovlev Design Bureau, making it similar to the Yak-130. This advanced trainer competes for the PLUF's next generation advanced trainer program against the Guizhou JL-9. The L-15 Falcon was more technologically advanced than the JL-9, but it was also more expensive to produce. The L-15 has a secondary light attack capability. It has four underwing hardpoints and three wingtip hardpoints for various weapons, including short-range air-to-air missiles, air-to-ground missiles, bombs and rocket pods. This aircraft is equipped with a number of advanced technologies such as digital fly-by-wire, hand-on-throttle and stick control. It also has good aerodynamic performance. Haig unveiled the L-15 aircraft design in September 2001 at the 9th Aviation Exhibition in Beijing. The large leading edge extension, LEX, design allows the aircraft to offer a maximum angle of attack of 30 degrees. The aircraft can also be converted into a light air-to-ground attack aircraft with minor modifications. This aircraft is designed to train pilots of third-generation fighter aircraft including the Su-27, Su-30, J-10 and J-11. The improved design provides safety for pilots while reducing training costs compared to its competitors. Development of the Hongdu L-15 began when Hongdu planned a modern trainer that would meet the PLUF's new generation fighter aircraft requirements. The Russia-based Yakovlev Design Bureau helped create the L-15 because it resembles the Yak-130. The initial prototype was launched in September 2005 and made its maiden flight in March 2006. The second prototype completed its first flight in May 2008. The first and second prototypes were powered by two ZMKB Progress, Lodorev, DV2 engines. An improved version, the DV2F, offering afterburner capability, was installed on the third model. The Ukrainian Ivshenko Progress AI-222K25F turbofan engine with afterburner was incorporated in later versions of the L-15. The Hongdu L-15 was displayed at the Dubai Air Show in November 2009 to promote the aircraft in the potential Middle East market. Haig will accept export orders from Africa, the Middle East and South America. The first operational variant powered by the Ivshenko Progress AI-222K25F turbofan engine was introduced in August 2010 after the completion of six months of production. The 
Hongdu L15 has a full glass cockpit that can accommodate two crew members, either a student pilot and instructor, or an authorized pilot and weapons systems officer. A multicolored head-down display is installed in the rear cockpit, while a head-up display is installed in the front of the cockpit. Fly-by-wire, FBW, and hands-on throttle and stick, HOTAS, digital flight control systems are also installed. The aircraft is also integrated with Full Authority Digital Engine Control, FIDEC, which reduces pilot workload by performing autopilot operations.